Cyber physical systems are largely regarded as the next generation engineering systems. They integrate computing, communication, and control, and they arise in diverse areas such as robotics, energy, transportation, civil infrastructures, and aerospace industry. A network control system where the feedback loop is closed over a communication channel is a fundamental component of cyber physical systems. A stabilization of an inverted pendulum where the sensor measures the angle of the pendulum and transmits it to the controller over a communication channel is an example of network control systems. In language, the pauses or timing between words in a sentence contains semantic information and the meaning of the sentence is partially encoded in this timing. In the same way, it is also possible to transmit information in communication systems not only by message contents or data payload, but also with its timing. Our goal is to use this concept of timing information in network control systems to encode and transmit information about the state of the system. As a result, in the encoding process, we answer the question of what and when to transmit. In other words, in our design in the sensor block, the quantized version of the state is encoded in a packet containing data payload as well as its timing. In this setting, Data Rate Theorem provides the communication channel requirements for a stabilization. It states that to ensure stabilization of an unstable linear system, the minimum information rate communicated over the channel, including both data payload and timing information, must be at least equal to the entropy rate of the plant, where the entropy rate of the plant captures the amount of system instability. Intuitively, Data Rate Theorem corresponds to balancing production and consumption of information. Traditionally, periodic control was used in digital systems simply because it was the easiest solution. However, it can be inefficient in sharing communication and computation resources in cyber-physical systems. Therefore, event-triggered control was introduced to transmit sensory data only when needed to satisfy control objectives. In our design, the sensor encodes information in timing with an event-triggering technique in a state-dependent fashion. Our goal is to propose an event-triggering strategy that utilizes timing information but transmitting in a state-dependent fashion. Details of the encoding-decoding scheme can be found in the paper. Now we present a set of experiments verifying the proposed control scheme using both timing information and data payload to stabilize an inverted pendulum over a digital channel with unknown bounded delay. In the first experiment, we set the channel delay upper bound to two sampling times. The results show information transmission rate, which is the rate at which the sensor transmits data payload is less than the entropy rate of the system. In the second experiment, we set the channel delay upper bound to seven sampling times. Because the upper bound of the delay is increased, uncertainty increases and timing information becomes outdated. Therefore, more information transmission rates are required to stabilize the plant. In the third experiment, delay upper bound is set to 7 sampling times. From the proposed method, we determine sufficient and necessary packet sizes for stabilization to be 5 and 1 beats respectively. We start decreasing the sufficient packet size until the system becomes unstable. In this setup, results show when the packet size is equal to 3 bits, the system becomes unstable. Finally, in the last experiment, we evaluate the robustness of the controller against additional external disturbances. 